Yeah, no, we're, well, listen, we are buzzing, we're delighted with it, but it's not a surprise for anyone in here. Um, and I think when you look at our squad on paper and you look at the reality of what they're performing, we may have a small budget, we may have not the fanciest of everything, facilities, everything else, but they're, they're in it together. They're fantastic, they've done brilliant. Um, and ultimately, I think there's a lot of managers across the league that would take quite a few of our players, which is a, is a massive compliment, in particular to the manager, the board, um, Martin Foyle's head of recruitment. So it's been going great, and hopefully we've achieved nothing yet. Hopefully we can kick on and, and keep this run going. So as always, we'll back ourselves. They're a, they're a top, top team with fantastic options, both starting and off the bench. But from our side of things, we fear no one at the minute. And um, it's one of them, cup game, have a go at it. There's no free hits because we don't believe in that. We believe we can compete with anybody. So um, on our day, I don't think they'll enjoy coming to St. Mirren. Um, so hopefully we can give them a right good game. Yeah, I think we're coming up in two years now in the job. So I think it's um, we've had the likes of like Kilty and Marcus Fraser, Ryan Flynn. These people have been here throughout. Um, we've kept a level of continuity, and I think we've gradually improved. I think last year, as much as we were fantastic, got the top six. Our style was sometimes maybe more out of possession, hard to beat, defend a box, um, up and at them a little bit. While I think last night, and in particular Saturday, they were like a vision of what we want the team to be maybe a bit more possession building through the thirds and a very very good press I think we're one of the highest pressing teams in the league so I think the boys trust the fact that we're a good side they trust the guy alongside them it's a small squad but a close-knit squad so it helps the fact that everyone's involved every week and um, and the feeling after the win is, is like a party because they, they're good mates they're good fellas they're young lads and, and they enjoy each other's company no, uh, well, Quan obviously um, comes out. Quan's done fantastic since he came in, um, but obviously can't play against his parent club. Um, Mark is a possibility for the squad. Um, we'll wait and see how he gets on the next couple of days. He's had that niggling thigh injury. Uh, other than that, Conor McMenamin, Ryan Strain, they're the longer-term ones. They won't be back yet.